Hello, this is Vampire. For today's video, I want to talk about the fan motion. Um, I recently got a question uh, where the person was asking me uh, about the fan motion. They said that they felt like they couldn't get like real solid power into the motion. So um, yeah, we'll talk about that real quick. Okay, so um, first of all, let me show what is the fan motion. Uh, generally speaking, it's usually taught uh, this way from the get-go. You go one, two, like so. One, two one two you could start from coming in from over here this way and then this is the second motion so it goes one two or you could do the other way where you start off this way where you're going outside and then you come to the inside so you go one two one two all right so generally speaking um i like to view the fan motion kind of like as a jab in boxing where it's more about speed than it is about power compared to like a uppercut uh, but still that being said though uh, it may be surprising at how much power that you can generate with the fan motion even though it's more about speed all right so the bottom line is that i recommend two different ways to practice the fan motion one is more where you're focusing on speed and number two is more where you're focusing on power so make that separation just like in boxing you would have a jab that's more designed for speed and you would also have a jab that's more designed for power. All right, so the first exercise that I wanna show you guys is more designed for speed, but I wanna work on speed first so that you can actually feel the difference when we start working more for power. So, all right, so the first one is, we're actually gonna go, like I said, the fan motion is one, two, two movements. Even if you go this way first and then that way, right? So you could go one, two, or you could go this way. You're going one, two. But for this one right now, what I want you guys to do is to go towards the inside. So that's number one. And then for number two, we're gonna strike. So one more time, one and then two. This may look very similar to a fan motion, but it's actually different. I am doing the inside strike. And then from here, normally we go to a, an outside strike like so, but instead I'm doing the inside strike and then I'm just hitting this way, okay, which is normally not a fan motion if this is just a simple strike where you're coming like that so i'm going one two one two one this way and then two is a strike coming out that way all right so for the second exercise what we're going to do is we're going to go towards the outside and normally we would go back towards inside so to complete the fan motion it would go outside inside but instead we're going to go outside and then instead of going inside, we're gonna just slash. So you're gonna go outside slash, outside fan motion, and then just do a winding motion in the other in the other direction to help you go into the slash. So here, and then normally we go this way, but instead we're gonna go outside into a slash, outside slash, outside slash, outside slash. All right, for this last part, we're gonna be working on generating some power. Okay, so these exercises designed this way. This is the motion to go right and left like this. And you're gonna get into a low stance. And first, we're gonna to go towards the outside this way. And then this is towards the inside. When you go towards the outside, we're gonna go all the way and you're actually gonna hit the floor. So hopefully, if you're indoors, I have carpet down here, so this works great. Um, if you are uh, indoors, you want carpet. If not, please do it outdoors. And you want grass, you want dirt, but you don't want to do it on concrete because you could damage your your uh, your weapon there. So, all right, from right here, I'm just going to go all the way, and I'm going to make contact with the ground. One, two, one, two. You could. I hope you guys can hear that you can generate quite a bit of power from this motion right here. So that's this way, and now I'm gonna go the inside direction. So inside direction, shh, shh, shh. So if you practice it this way, you can see that now rather than speed, we're working on power. So anyway, please have fun practicing these techniques. Thank you for watching, and take care, folks.